What's up locals? We are coming at you again with another side-by-side -side comparison doing chain versus local. We are at Da Chicken Shack and more. It's a branch off of Da Cajun Shack that's over on 21st Street on the east side. But this location is on the west side, 13th Street, right across from Ace Hardware. I see it right over there. I bought a, bought a screwdriver from there today. Right on. <laughs> this kind, right? Yeah. Flathead. Right Flathead. Flathead. No Phillips. All right, well, let's get into it. The Chicken Shack versus Popeyes. Here we go. First impression. Popeyes, actually, this tender's a little longer, and it is definitely looking more crispy than the... Uh, than the Chicken Shack, but we're gonna give it a try and see. I'm gonna go with the Chicken Shack first. No sauce, here we go. These are hot, these are still warm. Just got here, got the chicken, so really close to cook time here. Chicken's got a good flavor. It's uh, not, not as juicy as I expected, but it's still moist and really, this uh, part of the breading right here it's pretty crunchy. It's got a good flavor. Um, here you can get it spicy and mild, just like you can at Popeyes. And uh, actually, that was a really good bite of a chicken tender. So now I'm gonna jump into the pie pie, pie pies, Popeyes. Here we go. That's good. Definitely with the chain, the Popeyes, I do taste more grease and more, uh, just more of the batter and the seasoning. Then I get the chicken with the, the kitchen shack. There's just much more chicken there to taste. So it's like a bigger, thicker piece of chicken than you get at Popeye's, at least with this piece. So this is a really tough choice for me being a uh, Louisianan because I got Popeye's Louisiana chain chicken and I got the chicken shack. Who the owners here are originally from Bogalusa, Louisiana. And this is a good piece of Louisiana chicken. So as far as a winner for me, I definitely would go with the Chicken Shack. Um, they don't have a drive through like Papa's though. So if you like drive through you might want to go here. But I'm going to uh, give the winner to the Chicken Shack just for the fact that it has more chicken and uh, you could just taste the chicken better than you can in the pie pies. But it's a close race here. They're both pretty good. What do you think, Darren? Okay, so I'm excited to try these chicken tenders. Uh, the Popeyes, yes, does look crispier. Uh, feels crispier texture-wise. Uh, this is a little bit more smoother, silkier in texture. Uh, but let's see what's on the inside, because that's the important part. So, no sauce, good white meat, chicken tender. Don't know why I need to say that. That's really good flavor. So the chicken is uh, cooked, but it's not overly juicy. Just definitely a very well put together chicken dinner. But let's go to Popeyes and see what how they did. I can already see. I can already see. There's some orange. Oh, what's going on here? Breading is really good. The chicken just has a little bit more moisture to it than um, the chicken shacks. Um, but they are like really close, just like what Troy was saying. Really, the only difference between the two is the breading, in a sense. And Popeyes. What we have is a little spicier, spicier version of a chicken tender, but I personally would like that anyway. So anyway, just going side by side, these are really good. So next I want to try it with ranch because I love some ranch dressing. So definitely as I dig in, one thing I definitely notice off the bat is there's a somewhat crispiness to the Popeyes and this is just smooth. The breading is smooth. It's not overly crunchy. Uh, this is, between these two, man, I'm really digging the, the Chicken Shack's version of the chicken tender. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to let Darren review the ranches because we have a homemade ranch from the Chicken Shack and we have a buttermilk just contained ranch that you get at Popeye's. I'm going to let Darren do those, but the Chicken Shack has their own special sauce, which I love. It's very good. It's got like a slight Cajun flair to it, definitely mayonnaise base. So if you come get some chicken or if you come get some catfish or whatever you get from the Chicken Shack or the Cajun Shack, definitely try their secret sauce with their secret special sauce with whatever you get. So we're gonna use the Chicken Shack's tender. We're gonna 
we're going to dip it in Popeyes' fun buttermilk ranch. Um, I'm sure it's Popeye's secret recipe. <laughs> it's not bad. It's not my favorite ranch, but it's ranch. It'll do. Oh, oop, oop, submerging. Much better. Uh, this has a little tang to it. Don't ask me why. <laughs> there is a little bit of tanginess to this. Uh, this is just is good old-fashioned ranch. It's just good, simple, clean. And that's how ranch should be. Um, don't need anything fancy, it's just ranch. Um, but it should complement the chicken tender or anything that you're using to dip into the ranch. Overall, these are both really good. Just two different, two different styles. Even though they're both Cajun, uh, they ha each have different characteristics, but, who, man, that's a, like a 50-50 for me. I like both. Um, just because they're both simple. So in my quest for living local, I would definitely support the chicken shack. Um, man, why is that so hard? I keep, well, I keep wanting to say the Cajun, because that's the, like, the, I see that one right. at my house. So in my quest for living local, I would definitely support the chicken shack. <laughs> because they have a really good chicken tender here. And looking at their menu, man, they have other fun things as well. But today we're talking about chicken tenders. Popeyes does have a drive-thru, but honestly, even when a place has a drive-thru, I still want to go inside. I just don't know what it is. I like going in and talking to people and looking at the menu and just taking my time to order. I'm not in a hurry. That's what I got. I think it's still running on me. Well, stay tuned for more. We're going to keep doing these. Uh, keep giving us feedback and comments. We love it. Promise. And we will always reply. As always, I'm Troy. And I'm Darren. And we're reminding you to live local. See you next time. See ya. In my quest for living local, I would definitely support the, the kitchen. Is it like this? Um, are we on? Are we on? <laughs> All right, so the kitchen shack. I said kitchen. <laughs> Even though they're both Louisiana. They're bo <laughs> they looked like new customers, and they just said they would be back. Whoop, whoop. What's up, locals? Today we are at the Cajun Shack doing another side-by-side uh, -side chain versus local for you. TV timeout. Where are we at again? What'd I say? The Cajun Shack. <laughs> Get it right, my man.